Kate Allen is their UK director. Uh, good evening to you. Evening. Two things there. The body of stories um, now growing and very similar, which would suggest, you know, we are moving towards a critical mass of truth there. But also this failure to get enough aid in. So, yes, I mean, we have also documented the um, firebombing of villages and have shown that through satellite imagery. We've seen also the use of landmines, uh, which are illegal. And as you say, we now have uh, almost 400,000 people uh, who have crossed the border. Uh, and Bangladesh is one of the poorest countries in the region. But the, the, the only other issue would be that it is very difficult to have people monitoring the situation in Rakhine province. So have amnesty personnel seen this violence actually occurring? So we have been on the border uh, and we have talked to many, many people who have crossed that border, but we have also used our satellite imagery mm -hmm. uh, and environmental imagery, to, which has shown uh, that those fires have been set. Now, you know, um, uh, the Burmese military and Aung San Suu Kyi say that the Rohingya are burning their own villages. That is nonsense. There is an absolutely consistent pattern of the stories that have been told about the military turning up and setting fire but to villages. Would you um, agree with comments that have been made that this is akin or amounts to ethnic cleansing and even some people are talking about genocide? This is absolutely ethnic cleansing and it is crimes against humanity on a massive scale. This is targeted specifically at the Rohingya. You know, we've shown with our satellite imagery where there have been villages, one uh, called Indin, where um, in one part of the village, the properties that uh, uh, non-Rohingya live in are still standing. Mm -hmm. The other side of the village has been burnt to the ground. But this is totally targeted at the Rohingya. It is ethnic cleansing. There is no doubt about that. Now, um, the UN are discussing uh, the situation next. What do you want both the UN to do, but also the international community to do or not to do? So uh, the UN General Assembly uh, meets in the next few days. Mm -hmm. So we will see the international community uh, at the UN. This has to be really high on their agenda. We are in the middle of ethnic cleansing on a scale which is massive. So we want uh, that the international community to put absolute pressure upon the military within uh, Myanmar and tell them that this has to stop. We want to see but that those pressure, landmines. That pressure is there already. And, and it's, it, not there, it's not there enough and it's not there consistently uh, and it is absolutely not there enough. So we need that. We need there to be support for those refugees uh, in uh, Bangladesh. We need to see um, a, a complete end to any arms sales into that country. So, you know, we need to see that concerted uh, diplomatic effort focused to stop what is happening.